Hello, I'm Lucinda Puebles, Assistant Superintendent of School Performance and Culture, and today we're here to celebrate at Santa Ana High School the NJROT Pass and Review, and also to celebrate a collaboration with the Art Department for their beautiful mural, uh, recognizing the dedication of our veterans and our, our military personnel. Uh, this collaboration really shows the richness of our community, um, the patriotism, and the wonderful skill and talent that our children have in Santa Ana Unified School District. So it's a, a great day of celebration today. The mural was fantastic. The talent that was displayed and the kids who participated, awesome. Um, but not only was there interest in art, it was also in honoring our veterans, honoring our fallen soldiers, honoring our, our hi the history and the culture of our country, our great country, and the men and women who serve it. Um, to honor the, the Marines and the Navy, to have Army um, representatives here, to have all disciplines here from our U.S. military is, is just a statement and it shows our kids how important service to our country really is. Judy Westing has been really supportive. She had her entire uh, AP class working on this, and it, it was just awesome. They but did an incredible job. They did. And Judy called me and she said, well, we're, we're trying to figure out what to do. See, that last board was done by Maria Hernandez, the, the young lady that graduated in June, and the AP art person that made all this happen. Uh, so. Judy calls me and says, you, you know that poem about it's not the poet, it's a soldier? And I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I Googled it, I found it, I gave it to Judy, and that's what they gave me on that last board. And Commander, you're in that. I am. <laughs> <laughs> we got Oliver, Osick, and Flater, and, and, uh, <laughs> and then we, we, just, we just hired Sandercock. And so what we're going to do is we're going to put uh, First Sergeant Insignia here and put Sandercock here so he doesn't feel left out. Hi, my name is Judy Westing. I'm the visual arts teacher at Santa Ana High School. This is my 19th year. And I worked with Commander Osek to create this beautiful mural with my students. And my students helped in the planning. We found iconic images throughout the history of our country. And then each student was kind of in charge of one panel. So I'm going to talk to David here. Stand up, David. Tell us which panel you worked on. Um, I worked on the panel, the Vietnam one. Uh, so our, my panel represents the Vietnam War, and it's a, it's a famous image from National Geographic. And, you know, it was like, it was really hard painting it because the, the person has a lot of folds, so it was like, it was, the shading and everything that we had to do took a lot of time, you know, after school and in class too. So we had it was a sacrifice, but in the end, you know, seeing the finished product it, and being a part of you know the school and like it, it's gonna be there for years and years to come and it's it's gonna be history. So I like it's nice to be a part of it. Hi, this is Yuritsa, and Yuritsa was a big part of our mural, and she's going to tell you what she worked on and what she found to be maybe challenging and rewarding about the experience. So I worked on the Vietnam War panel, and the most difficult part that I found was the shading of the hands, because I took in the part where I had to shade the hands, and since the, the man in the picture, he, he had like a bunch of veins and like, it was very um, detailed. detailed, yeah, in the way his hands were positioned. So it took a lot of effort and time to blend in the paint with, with, the, with his fingers and knuckles. So, yeah. What did you find rewarding about this experience? Rewarding? Um, I found that it's, it was honorable for me to like, paint for something that our country, you know, soldiers go out and they fight for our country. So I think it was very important for us to paint something in honor of them. So. Thank you so much, Sharitza. Thank you for all your time that you committed after school. She came in during the summer and helped me out. So thank you so much for giving back to your school and, and to our community.